So, recent speculations suggest that Apple's upcoming A18 Pro chipset, anticipated to power the iPhone 16 Pro models set for release in September this year, may exhibit significant improvements in single-core performance. These rumors indicate that the A18 Pro could surpass the capabilities of the current flagship chipset, the A17 Pro, and even outperform the M3 chipset in single-core tests. As per information shared by a tipster on X, Apple's Hexacore A18 Pro chipset purportedly achieved an impressive score of 3,500 points in the single-core test and 8,200 points in the multi-core test on Geekbench 6. When compared to the A17 Pro, notable enhancements in both single and multi-core scores are apparent. The A17 Pro presently scores around 2,800 to 2,900 points in the single score and approximately 7,200 in the multi-core score, indicating a roughly 20% gain in single-core performance. In a direct comparison with Apple's M3 chip, utilized in its latest Macs, the A18 Pro demonstrates superior performance in the single-core category, registering around 3,170 points. However, when pitted against the Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 Gen 4, the next-generation chipset expected to succeed the recently launched Snapdragon 8 Gen 3, the A18 Pro falls short in the multi-core test. The Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 purportedly achieved scores of 2,845 in the single core and 10,628 in the multi-core test. Shifting focus to the software aspect, during Apple's quarterly earnings call, CEO Tim Cook confirmed the company's efforts in developing generative AI features. Cook hinted at an upcoming announcement on these generative AI features later this year, likely coinciding with the release of iOS 18. During the earning calls Tim Cook said that, in terms of generative AI, which, I guess, is your focus, we have a lot of work going on internally as I've alluded to before. Our mo, if you will, has always been to do work and then talk about work and not to get out in front of ourselves. And so, we're going to hold that to this as well. But we've got some things that we are incredibly excited about that we'll be talking about later this year. While Cook did not delve into specific details about Apple's application of AI, including the devices or platforms it will encompass, Code within iOS 17.4 suggests potential applications such as Siri utilizing AI for summarization, smart reply suggestions and messages, and integration of AI across apps like Apple Music, Pages, and Keynote. The company is reportedly exploring various AI models, with some running on device and others relying on internet connectivity. So, what do you guys think about the upcoming iPhone 16 series? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below, and as always, I will see you guys in my next video.